Hey, what's up, Ball is Life? Uh, it's your man, 8 Paul Enforcer, coming at you with uh, some sports news that's been going on. So, yeah, let's get right into it. The Cleveland Cavaliers have hired David Blatt as their newest head coach. Blatt has spent the last couple of decades in Europe as a successful coach. The questions now remain, can he translate to the NBA? Jojo Embiid, possible first pick in the upcoming draft, underwent surgery on his draft stock, is falling slightly. All eyes are on LeBron James and Carmelo Anthony as the new NBA world waits to see where, where, where they decide to play next season. You know, my thoughts on that is that uh, I kind of have a feeling that uh, Carmelo Anthony is going to sign with the Chicago Bulls. Uh It'd be good if he'd sign with the Boston Celtics because that's my favorite team. But I think he's going to sign with the Bulls. LeBron James, I'd say he's either going to stay in Miami or go back to Cleveland. I mean, people are so confident that he's going to stay in Miami. But, I mean, the Cavs, they got Kyrie Irving. They could draft Jojo Embiid. And then and then uh, if LeBron goes back to Cleveland, he has a young team around him to work work with that have more energy left in them than Miami Heat, LeBron James, Chris Bosh, especially Ray Allen. So, yeah, <clears throat> that's my thought about that. And, sadly, the Major League Baseball has lost um, a great legend of theirs, Mr. Padre, former San Diego Padre, Tony Gwynn. I'm not exactly sure you, how you pronounce his name, but I think it's Gwyn. But yes, Tony Gwynn, may you rest in peace. He was 54 years old when he passed away. And that's sad because uh, 54 is not, it's obviously not young, but like it's a young age to die at. So may he rest in peace. Uh, and Richard Sherman. We all know Richard Sherman uh, likes to get into some beef and... Uh, yeah, he got into a scuffle at training camp. At training camp, even after winning a Super Bowl, the Seahawks are so feisty. Yeah, that's, that's a good thing. The Seahawks they like to get in your grill, especially Sherm. This is not, not this is not NFL, but Chad Johnson made his debut for the Montreal. Alutes or Alouettes in the CFL, however you pronounce that. And uh, World Cup Soccer, or some of you might be from a place where you call it football or football, but I'm from the U.S., so I'm going to call it soccer. World Cup is off to a great start. Uh, Spain and England have already been eliminated, while other teams like Costa Rica and Chile, I think that's how you pronounce it, continue to surprise all football fans. So, yeah, that's all I got for you right now. Uh, it's your boy, A. Paul Enforcer, signing off.